that it does start in a lab. It, start, it starts with an idea, an idea turns into a, a plan, and a plan turns into a research application, and that turns into a project, and then from there it, it's, uh, that, that goes into results. So every piece of research that's done is done with a social purpose in mind, because the work is all about people. A rabbit muscle. Well, really the objective of having open houses like the one we're having today um, at the Welso and Muscarisi Center is to give patients and their families and the general public the opportunity to see the type of research that we're doing here at the University of Minnesota. Yeah. Muscarisi is essentially the wasting or loss of skeletal muscle, which is very important for all the activities that we do daily being able to walk, being able to breathe. Science is going on at the level of test tube uh, science all the way to uh, studies in uh, patients where uh, these therapies are being tested in clinical trials. Well, yeah, you do. You have to be your own advocate, especially when you have a rare disease because there's nobody that cares, you know. And that's why, you know, it's exciting to see that you really, really caring and doing something and a lot more of the company is getting involved with this. To put a human face on the patients that um, suffer from these conditions give us added incentive to work even harder to advance the research towards effective therapies, but also to let the, 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 the outside world know that we are trying. State level is where we've incurred the most drastic cuts, and over the last 10 years we've grown the institution, uh, doubled it in size, uh, but have had to you know, we've experienced a 25% drop in state money. So we need money to operate on. We can't simply sustain ourselves by increasing tuition. Research is so important. It's so relevant. Uh, it's so needed. But we need government support. It's a true partnership.